All right, if you are looking to adopt a pet, the Humane Society of Memphis and Shelby County has you covered. I'm here with Portia White, who has a very special guest who is just <laughs> making himself so comfortable right now. Who is this, Portia? This is Saban. Okay. He is a one and a half year old lab mix. He's available for adoption. Okay, tell me a little bit about his story, his personality. He seems pretty chill and laid back. Is that the case? As you can see, very chill, very laid back. Um, he was brought to us by a Good Samaritan okay. who found him running at large. He was a little bit um, hungry and thin when she found him, but unfortunately they were not able to keep him, so okay. they brought him to us and we decided to take him in and help find him a home. Okay, what type of home do you think he'd be pretty good in? Honestly, any home. Okay. He's pretty <laughs> laid back. I don't know if we've brought him around kids yet, okay. but it's definitely something that we could try if you let the adoption team know. Perfect. All right, yeah. you guys are always so busy. You have a lot mm -hmm. going on. Tell us, you know, what everybody out there needs to know and some of the clinics and things you'll have going on. Yeah, we have a lot going on. So as I was mentioning to you earlier off camera, if you are interested in helping us spread the word with dogs like Sabin and other dogs that are available for adoption, we have foster field trips. You'll sign up online and get a hold of our foster coordinator if you're interested. So you can take them around uh, to dog friendly places yeah. that we approve of and let them know that they're available. Our big event is tomorrow. Okay. It's our mobile vaccine clinic, 8.30 to noon behind the building. Uh, it is free microchip, uh, rabies vaccine, DPAP and FERCP mm -hmm. vaccine. It is $10 if okay. your pet is spayed or neutered. It is $20 if they are not. You can bring cats and dogs, but your cat will need to be in a carrier. Yeah, if you bring one. And for some perspective, like ten, twenty dollars. Normally, this can be upward. Like how it Ooh. very expensive. <laughs> I think it varies from clinic to clinic. Okay. I'm not a veterinarian or vet tech, but yeah. I will say that this is less than half the cost of yeah. what most people out there are paying for those um, for those vaccines. So it's a great service to the community, and we're really happy to do it. And then the need. Tell us the importance of making sure. I mean, honestly, we're hitting the springtime, summertime. That can be parvo season for a lot of dogs. So it's really important to protect your dog and vaccinate them, especially if you've got somebody who's a buddy like Sabin, um, <laughs> who you want to take with you everywhere. You could be exposing them to other dogs that aren't vaccinated. Yeah. So it's really important that you do that for your dog. Awesome. Thank you so much, Portia. So all of that information will be on our website. And if you have other questions, if you want more information about Sabin or any other pets, you can go to memphishumane.org and click on the Adopt a Pet tab. We'll be right back.